digging holes. This is my garden. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it this year. Let me show you what I'm working with over here. Here's the cool fence thing I made last spring. This is kind of fun. This is a very silly cement table that my husband and I <laughs> made for fun. And I put it in here. It's like great for, you could put your chair there and then put your tea or coffee and read a book. I gotta do something with these leaves. You loved the garden last year, didn't you? You want another one this year? Yeah. Oh my gosh.
madness. This has certainly changed a lot. Let's see. Oh, she's checking it out for the first time. Oh. All right, well, still have a long ways to go. This has been a ton of fun. I gotta keep going. But so far, the cat likes it. Okay, this might be crazy, but what if I made this super deep and these super tall? Yeah, I want the steps to go like closer to the edge there. That's where they should be. Because the idea is, how cool would it be for these mounds to be high? and then sunflowers or flowers on there and then it's like this crazy privacy thing and you're in here and it's awesome. Wouldn't that be so cool, like a magical world? That's what I'm going for. I do have to remember though to shovel with my right hand now because I'm like left hand dominant in a couple things like hockey, baseball, shoveling and the whole left side of my back, that long muscle is so sore. I gotta switch to my right but it doesn't work so well. Wish me luck. That's gonna be it for tonight.
dirt pit hole is reminding me about life right now. Like a lot of people looking in are like, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> you know, it, you're just digging in the dirt and you have this ugly dirt pit. But from my perspective, I have a vision and I know I can see the vision I have for this pit. <laughs> sunflowers bordering, shooting way up, blocking everything, so I have privacy in here. I see the inner walls co covered in wildflowers, poppies, cornflowers, daisies. I feel the cool dirt on my back during a hot summer in the future, maybe sipping a shandy. <sighs> the cats playing around, feeling clover on my feet. I have a vision for the future of this dirt pit, but no one else can see it. And that reminded me about life, like, I'd say in my life right now, my life is in the dirt pit stage. I'm digging, I'm doing the work, I'm doing something strange, and people don't really understand it. People don't understand why I'm doing what I'm doing and where I'm hoping to go. And that's okay. I don't need them to understand it. What matters is that I see it and I believe in it and I know it's going to be beautiful in the end. So long as I keep putting in the effort, keep putting in the work, here's the base foundation. Then I will plant the seeds. Then I will nurture the seeds and weed out the invaders. I will water. <laughs> so I just not quite the life analogy through that and maybe that could encourage someone just because you're in the trench right now and no one else can see where you're going but you know where you're going keep it up don't let what others say deter you just keep on digging I like digging holes all right I'll see you guys later make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any updates on the evolution of this garden. It's gonna be epic. <laughs>